Sorry my hair is looking crazy, I just got done working out and I wanted to film this video before I showered. I know TMI, but whatever. Before this video gets started, since I know the thumbnail was crazy and it didn't really look like my update videos, I did in fact get the leggings from Amazon. They are the scrunch leggings and I did a TikTok on them. They are so cute. I really like them. They are a little tight. I feel like they'll loosen up over time, but overall, they're so cute. I just got them today and I really want to start working out in them so I can do like a review of them. They are from Amazon. If you want to get a pair, I will have a link down below so you can purchase some. They're only like $25 and I know that they're really popular on TikTok and I did make a TikTok. So if you guys have a TikTok, it would mean the world to me if you followed me on there. My content is like mediocre, but you know, we're trying here. I feel like TikToks are so hard to make because I'm just always having to retake things and then sometimes I almost delete everything and I did delete everything <laughs> when I was doing the um, leggings TikTok. I don't know. I guess I'm not a TikToker. <laughs> I'm definitely a YouTuber. All right, we've established that. So um, like normal, I am going to share with you what I did this week and then we will get into the photos. There's only going to be a couple photos because of what I'm going to do is I'm using last week's photo as like the start of the new year. So that photo is going to be the one that I'm going to compare to. So there's only going to be one photo. So this week I started out again doing Chloe Ting. So on Saturday I didn't do anything because I normally don't do anything on Saturday. Sunday I did the 15 minute full body hit. I always do the warm up but I feel like that gets really really repetitive so I just don't film that part. So I did the 15 minute full body, the flat belly abs, and the booty workout. This program is from her online 2021 shred program. So that's where I'm getting these. Um, then on Monday, I did the January 11th 10 minute hit weight loss, the two weeks abs and the booty workout twice, but I didn't film myself doing the booty workout twice because again, that's really, really repetitive. And I just think that there was no point in me showing you guys me doing the workout twice. Then on Tuesday, I don't work out, so I have no footage there. Wednesday, I did the warm up, obviously, the tone arms, the core and arms, and then I do the Pamela Reef. I know I kind of changed the schedules because her cool down is 15 minutes and that's just way too long for me. So I just do the five minute stretch thing by Pamela Reef and that like helps me and it's just more efficient. So that is what I did on Wednesday. Oh, also I wanted to, well, this will be in the updates part, but I also did the Alexis Rin abs on Wednesday, the day that I did the tone arms and the core and arms. Then on Thursday, I do not work out at all. Kind of took the day to myself and we actually had four rivers. So that was a big treat for us. And then today I did the warm up. Then I did the 15 minute full body hit. That is so hard. Like I always lose my breath during that. I think I don't breathe properly. And then I did the flat belly abs and the January January 13th lower ab workout and I think her ab workouts are pretty good but they're definitely not as challenging as I would want so I guess now we're just gonna move on to the updates which that's definitely an update I wish Chloe's ab workouts were a little bit challenging the two-week shred abs that has like millions and millions of views that one's very effective I really like that but the other ones that I've been doing they're like all right I just wish they were a little bit more challenging I liked her abs and weights workout that was super challenging but other than that I'm just like kind of um, another update I wanted to share with you guys is when there's not a workout that includes abs on a day, I'm going to do the Alexis Ren video because that was one of my goals this year was to work on my abs and like lower stomach because I really think that I can improve in that area and it's like an area that I'm like self-conscious about sometimes. So I just really want to push through and work on it as well as overeating. I started out yesterday 
yesterday and even though I didn't have the most healthy things, the portions were like a little bit smaller and I just really want to work on portion control. That's my biggest problem. Like when I have Triscuits, I mean, I literally eat like the entire, no, not the entire, but I literally eat like half of the box because I'm like scrolling on my phone and just like shoving my face. I think now I'm definitely going to like count out how many Triscuits and like definitely pay more attention to portions because that's I think my biggest issue and I really do want to like lose like a layer of fat and how that's gonna happen you need to burn more than you consume so just logically that is what I'm going to work on um, I don't want to cut out certain foods because I you know had Panera today and I had a cookie but instead of having mac and cheese I just had a larger salad um, just trying to compromise and just rearrange some things so um, I can improve in that department. Let's just move on to the photos. So Alex on the left is last week and Alex on the right is this week. And here is the side view of that. I know there's not much of a difference, but um, I definitely feel a difference because the past couple days I've really taken that initiative to like watch my portions and stuff and just be more mindful about that. Um, I guess that is pretty much it for this video. I know it was kind of like short and sweet and I know some of you guys really Really don't like these videos because you think they're repetitive but they're so like therapeutic to me and for me and I just like doing them so I mean I've never done YouTube I mean of course I would love this to be my career but I never want to feel like I can't post something because it's not what someone wants to see there's a beautiful button called the hide button which I use all the time for people that I'm subscribed to um, that I like certain videos of theirs so feel free to use that button if it it pleases you to do so. Um, I would still love to have you be around my channel. Maybe there's some other videos you like that I do. Um, but anyway, yeah. So give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.